Hey, hi there, Aries. Thank you for watching your tarot forecast for May 2018. This is a sample four card reading. The first card for the first week is the Ten of Pentacles. The second week, the Sun. The third week, the Queen. And the fifth week is a five, the Hero Pent. This is a general reading. Um, I've noticed that sometimes the energies intermingle the weeks, which they've done for me. Email me with private questions. I'm here to help guide you. Thanks so much for your like, share, and subscribe. The cards have been blessed and shuffled for you. Your first card, Aries, is the Ten of Pentacles. The Ten of Pentacles. That represents home and family, a solid and secure life. Perhaps someone marrying into money or an inheritance coming. It is a monetary gain and increased stability. It's an enjoying your fruits of the labor. It could stand for a house or a dwelling. It has to do with security and material comfort. It has to do with wealth and social standing. Traditions. Think about how your elders would have solved the issue. You have a goal realized with some family functions. Your second week, Aries, is the sun. Second week, Aries, the sun. And I often read the sun as brightening the cards next to it. It stands for clarity and optimism and radiance, attainment and liberation, marriage, fulfillment, success for the future, letting your light shine, contentment and joy, freedom, enthusiasm, playfulness. It's a card of light. You will benefit from sharing your thoughts. The outcome to your question is yes. A gift from spirit unfolds naturally. Your third card for the third week, Aries, is the Queen of Swords. The Queen of Swords. This can be a person with air qualities. They have independent thoughts. They're mature. They have authority. This could be someone that's a Libra or Aquarius or Gemini. This person has a keen mind. They could be a writer, or a minister, or a lawyer, sometimes your doctor. They are strong-willed. They are able to co cope with loss. This person provides solutions. They are truthful and honest. They accept life as it is. They will provide clarity and wisdom. They will give you good advice and maybe professional counsel is needed. Your fourth card is the five, the hero pint. Here. That's living by a higher code and spiritual truths. It's love through helpful doctrines. It's marriage sometimes, an alliance. It's religious or spiritual urge. It's focusing on the moral or ethical matters. Could be ministering or teaching or learning. Could be making a vow. Could be receiving a blessing. You're supposed to act with integrity. And when you do that, it, it's its own reward. Thank you, Aries. Hope this reading resonated with you and answered a question. I look at all the comments and I respond. Thank you very much. Love and light.